Hi, we're guys doing stuff, and today we're making poster frames. Yeah, so we don't have so many thumbtack holes in the wall. Do, 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 do. Go! What we'll need for this project is four identical pieces of wood, two of which that have magnets in them, and we'll need a binder clip. We want what we're making to be just a little bigger than this, so we're going to measure it. So our magnets are 3 16 of an inch. We're going to move our fence so it's 3 8 of an inch. So we have more room. We have a lot of posters, so we're going to need a lot of poster hangers. I'm going to rip a couple 2x4s into strips that we'll then cut to size later. Looks like about 22 and a half inches. Okay, we need 22 and a half inches, so I've set up this cardboard box as kind of a stop block, and we can just knock these out uh, real quick. So now we're gonna drill small holes into this board on both sides so we can fit a small magnet without going through the back. So we've set up this jig so that the boards can't go further than here, they can't go further than here. We'll drill in the same spot every time. All right, sanding isn't fun. Nobody likes to sand. But it has to be done, so I guess Dad has to do it. that are already in the board so that it matches the polarity. And then, we push these down so that the two match. When we pull them up, the magnet will be stuck. And the other one, we just pound it down so we know they match. And now we get out the rubber mallet again. Start whacking it. So now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it together. We put one on the bottom so that it doesn't curl up. And if you put it here, they'll actually stick because we have two magnets right here. Okay, enough for the top. So we take these pieces of wood that don't have any magnets on them, put them, put one under the poster, and put one on top of the poster like that. And then we take a binder clip. clip it together. Okay, so we put a thumbtack on the wall and now we're ready to hang it up. Put it right against the metal part of the binder clip. 
That makes a perfect hanger. Ta-da! If you like what you saw, please like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos. I'm Gus. <laughs>